Welcome back. We saw Bugela in the link on our SABC One Zanzi for sure. Don't forget if you want to interact with us, do hashtag us on Twitter hashtag the link. And joining me in studio tonight is SABC Sports presenter and radio DJ because I believe she still is. Mpa my boy. <laughs> Be, uh, listen, you'll always be a radio DJ to me. I know you, you, you've you been insisting that, look, <laughs> you're a radio DJ. <laughs> what did you take from that journey? I got to learn a lot about Mpo okay. and the person she is, and I got to control my temper. Did you ever have an awkward moment on air? I've had lots of awkward moments okay, on one, air. One, one where you were like, <laughs> I will never forget this. <laughs> um, once where I told a listener who had irritated me <gasps> to go back to KZN. <laughs> Oh, <laughs> I got suspended for that. But now, if you follow Mpo on Twitter, you'll know she's like a sports fanatic. I actually tweet a lot more about soccer, but I also follow rugby and cricket. Mm -hmm. Those are my other two um, favorite things. But I don't tweet as much about them because I'm not really in those fields. Yeah. Um, so once in a while, I'll tweet about the cricket or I'll tweet about the rugby, but mainly it's about football. EPL, PSL, La Liga, mm -hmm. love it. Have you always loved soccer? I used to go to the stadium with my dad. Oh, and wow. I used to sit with him and his friends, like as a kid, I would mm -hmm. sit with him and his friends and they would always be watching soccer and I was there and I'd be like, Daddy, what, does a, what is an offside? Because you know, you see them yes, going, offside, yes. offside, and you're mm -hmm. like, okay, what's that? So he would sit down and, and teach me the rules uh, of the game. So yeah. from a very young age, I've always loved uh, soccer because of my dad. We used to play soccer, remember? Yes, we did. The yes, girls' we soccer. Did. Yeah. There was quite a number of us. There was myself, you, Shubi, uh, Chomi, Chomi Kelly. Yeah, there was a number. Back of the, uh, yeah, back, now back, we give away our ages. Then. Way back when. But anyway, a lot of people don't know that you're actually from the East End, right? Yes. Yeah, where exactly? Kitoko Vuta, I grew up town. Okay. It was just like growing up in Kasi, any other Kasi, I think. Um, you know, Waking up in the morning with Alale Bashimani, mm -hmm. the whole day, yeah. coming back before the streetlights come on, you know? When did your fashion sense change? Because I followed you for a very long time. We've known each other for a very long time. Yeah. And you were the tomboy girl, the Aliyah, Sierra, Timberland, type, Timberland yeah. you know? <laughs> and I don't know, it just went, it flipped. To be very honest with you, I think mommyhood had a lot to do okay. with it. Um, Oddly, I never really used to care about fashion mm -hmm. and looking good and looking like a girl. Yeah. And when I became a mother, I was like, okay, now I can embrace my femininity. Mm -hmm. I've never really been one to follow fashion trends. Yeah. But I, what was you? I'm like, what's the peplum? Which one is the peplum? Which one is the peplum? Oh, that one. Oh, oh, yeah, oh. exactly. <laughs> and I'm enjoying playing, mm -hmm. you know, with my image and playing with my, my clothes. Because also I had dreadlocks for the longest time. Yes. So now yes. I can play with my hair. How has your life changed from back in the days when you know you weren't a mother until now? For one, mm -hmm. I used to party a lot. Yeah. You know, I yeah. was out almost every single day, literally. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. But now I'm I'm content being at home with mm -hmm. my son, um, especially because I work almost every day. Mm -hmm. um, now I just as much time as I can, mm -hmm. I spend with the baby. Mm -hmm. And and yeah, it's it's made me a calmer person. But you don't know where I have been. But you're actually uh, a singer. Yeah, that was me. Go papa. No, but you are actually a good singer. No, go papa. To be very honest, it's it's when I was still trying to find myself mm -hmm. and you know trying to dabble into everything. Mm -hmm. Like I would never do an album, mm -hmm. for instance. Yeah. Because I think there's those people who are very passionate about music, mm -hmm. and people like myself who just have that opportunity shouldn't yeah. take that away from somebody who's very passionate That's about true. it. You're also a writer. I do write my okay. every single song I've sang. What inspires your writing? A, a lot of things, um, but mainly love. I, I love love. I really love love. I'm just those people. When she says that, her face just... <laughs> oh. Because there's one person that came to my head. But anyway. I know. <laughs> Speaking of love, yeah. we're not going to say who you're in love with, but no. you are in a relationship. <laughs> nice one. He just happened at the most perfect moment. Yeah. Yeah. It's, it's, it's interesting, actually, mm. being in a relationship, especially when you're a mother. Yeah. Um, it's, it's very tricky, but I like that he... He understands. Yeah. And he he doesn't challenge or try to compete with my son. Yeah. He's an addition into my life. And oh, wow. He's, he's, I love that. Now you're on SAVC Sports. Congratulations. Yes, Thank Every you. Every Saturday at one o'clock. 
At 1.30? 1.30, yes. yes. How's that going? Smart. It's absolutely amazing. Yeah. When you're here, you get to talk to a little kid. You're talking to Ukoko, you're talking yeah. to Umama, Ubaba, Uputi. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. So you, 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 you are exposed to so much more. Mm -hmm. And now I get to do a lot more games, which is I've always loved being touchline. Mm -hmm. um, so I get to do that again. Can I, can I, can I give people advice? Mm -hmm. If you want to get into the industry and you love it, Mm -hmm. That's what you need to do it for. Don't do it because you want to see your face on the cover Very of a true. magazine. Mm -hmm. That's the worst reason you can actually get into the entertainment Very industry. True. Because okay. when you don't love what you do, mm -hmm. we can see it. All right, do make sure that you follow her on Instagram and Twitter, Mpo my boy. Once again, thank you so much for coming through. And next up is our must-see looks of the week.